everyone and welcome back to another episode of uh, building BMW Airhead motorcycle. In this episode I'm gonna paint the rims. There are two 18 inch rim from R65 BMW in front of me and I'm gonna paint them using Seracode. In the last episode I sandblasted uh, these two rims. If you haven't watched that the link is up here. And in this episode I'm gonna first clean this completely and you'll see the process and uh, prepare it for the paint and then we move to the paint booth and uh, start painting this. So for the paint I'm gonna use Seracode Burnt Bronze and you're gonna see that. I really like that paint. I hope you like it too. So let's get to it. We are back inside and we did some part of the cleaning process. First thing that we did, we used air compressor to just remove all the sands. The next thing that we did uh, was to use degreaser to remove the oil around the bearing area. And the last part is actually to use uh, thinner as a solvent to remove any remaining residue on the rings. And after that, for electrostatic, I'm gonna use tape cloth for the last part and that will be ready to be painted. Just one uh, point that I want to mention is that you need to wear gloves because on your skin uh, there are some oil that you don't want it to end up on your ring before it's painted. Okay, so you're gonna see that process in time lapse and after that we're gonna find some place uh, for these rings to be painted. And after that, it's going to be ready to be painted. For the paint, I'm going to use Seracote. So I made some videos about this. If you haven't watched, make sure that you go and watch it. And this is an air cube, so I don't need uh, any oven to do the ceramic coating. Okay, so I'm going to torch it first, and after that, we're going to paint it.
one drill is done and we're going to do the next one. The only thing that I want to mention is that if you want to do a paint job, please make sure that you have a good lighting situation. <laughs> At the back of this room, I don't have any good source of lighting. So it's really hard to see what I'm actually painting. So just make sure that you have a good lighting situation and you should be alright. Okay, I'm gonna torch this ring and then after that apply the cerro coat on it. Okay guys, it's been a week and the paint is completely cured. I really like the paint and the result. I think I need to polish it and make it a little bit more shiny. But overall, I love this color. Okay, this is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. See you in the next one.